Okay guys, uh, so basically I'm doing another video on how to prevent yourself from getting infections and, ba and, and also things like to look out for in the future so you won't get infected. I mean there's nothing really 100% but um, this is some like precaution steps you could do to help you out um, and kind of keep you, your computer maintaining at a proper speed that it should be. So first thing we want to do is uh, let's check to see what browsers you have. So a lot of people just use Internet Explorer. Definitely don't use Internet Explorer. Um, if you have to, to go to certain websites, use it for that. But I would always use either Firefox or Google Chrome. So um, I'm just going to download Firefox and Google Chrome. Uh, I'm going to go to my favorite website, 9night.com. Oops, sorry. 9night.com. Get Google Chrome, Firefox. Scroll down, get installer. Alright, run, hit yes. These are probably the two best browsers out there. Um, definitely it helps you a lot more than what Internet Explorer does. Internet Explorer is too open so it gets infected very easily. I know I've seen you guys comment saying that basically uh, your browser still don't work after your uh, virus scan so you still ha you constantly have to restart and explore all the time so that's why it's best to use these two um, I prefer Firefox a lot of people like Chrome whatever you prefer it doesn't matter so let's just wait this for these to install okay guys so once that's done just hit close now we can get out of the horrible Internet Explorer and now we have our two browsers over here so uh, I like to pin them down below. Uh, let me open up Firefox first. Um, you can import things if you want to uh, from your Internet Explorer. You don't have to. All right. So Firefox opens. Um, up. All right. And let me just make the screen a little bigger. So I'll go here. You go to options. So a lot, of, um, a lot of people always ask me what I like as my homepage. I always make Google my homepage because it, it's a very simple page and it loads a lot quicker. So I usually leave uh, Google as my homepage. Um, so let's close out of that. We can hit the house button now, and now you see that Google is the homepage. So let's also go over here, and then now you want to go add-ons. Uh, like in my other videos, I use Adblock. Adblock is a, a very good tool that blocks a lot of pop-ups, so that can really help you out, like to keep you away from getting infected. So just type Adblock in the search. Um, if yours come with Adblock Plus, you can get that. It also comes with Adblock just by itself. Um, doesn't matter. Both of them work pretty well. So you know when it's installed when you see this little symbol over here. And that's it for that. Uh, I'm going to show you guys on Google Chrome. The same stuff. Google Chrome is a little bit different. But uh, I'll show you. So this is the first time we are opening it. So it's asking us. It's going to ask us like things. Um, you, you can go through, sign up if you want. I'm just going to exit out of it. Uh, hit the three lines. Go to settings. Alright, so once you're in settings, uh, like I said, I like Google to be my homepage, so I, I usually hit this set of pages. And then I type in google.com. And then you can either, if you want the home button, like up here, to point back to your homepage, you could make it do that. Um, you can actually put it whatever you want, but uh, I prefer Google, so I always make it Google. All right, and then lastly, what we want to do is we want to add ad block. So in here, we go to extensions. 
Just go to get more extensions. All right, so once you're in get more extensions, so you had add, you just type in ad block. All right, and just hit add to Chrome. Add. All right, so you know it's installed when you see the icon right there. As you can see, the plus and the regular one um, ad block looks different, but doesn't matter. They both work pretty good. Uh, so those are two key factors that you should have to prevent you from getting a lot of infections uh, to block a lot of ads. I also wanted to talk to you guys about to not get infections. There's also um, you always want to look at your your URLs when you're accessing your websites. Make sure you're in the right domain that you're you're going to. Um, you don't want to go to a fake website uh, because then you'll get infections that way. Um, so let's say if you're going to facebook.com or something, right, and it says something else in the front, you always want to read what it says in the URL up top, like right there up front. Um, you never want to click on um, an infected URL. Usually they're long and then they have misspellings in them, so just look out for that. Um, also, what you want to look at is like when you're downloading things, a lot of people like to download images or like maybe software or something. Make sure that it's from the actual provider that you're down, downloading it from. Uh, you don't want to download something from a third party, pro, uh, like a third party website, because then you'll get infected as well. Um, lastly, don't use a third party installer. Um, I know a lot of companies nowadays are trying to use third-party install like uh, like Symantec. Symantec uses their own uh, installer for Norton. I mean, if you're on Norton's website, like when you purchase Norton, you have to go through their accounts, so that's legit. But if you're gonna download like let's say uh, a software that you're kind of like shaky about, Google it first, see if it's really legit before you download it. All right, uh, so those are three things that you should look out for also when you're uh, surfing the web and stuff like that. Um, uh, one more thing to uh, try not to click on a lot of ads and uh, pop-ups uh, because behind those you can also get infections as well. So you want to stay away from that. Um, and that's about it. Um, just leave a comment if you have any questions down below. Uh, this was just a short I just film. wanted to go over some ways to not get infected. Um, if you have any questions, leave comments below. Like I said, uh, like my uh, video and uh, please subscribe. Thank you.